Hi, Hiram here. I'm going to do another test on this simple carbon felt burner where instead of using the uh, one and a quarter inch by eight inch strip, I'm now going to use a three quarter inch high eight inch long strip. That way the carbon felt won't come up as high in the can. So I've got my strip here. All I got to do is roll it up which isn't easy to do with cold hands. The room temperature in here is about 43 degrees which is definitely warmer than outside but there we go. So I got it rolled up stick it down in a little in the can same can as I used before I don't know if you can see this in this light not all dark anyway the felt now is about a half inch down from the top. So I'm going to use another half of a fluid ounce of uh, alcohol with that. But right now I'm going to go get my water prepped and I'll be right back for a test. Okay, I'm back. Got my water ready. Here's one half fluid ounce, a half of a fluid ounce of methanol. Pour it into the burner. It's not quite to the top of the carbon felt in there. You probably can't see it. Let me light this. Okay, that's, that's lit. Pot stand. Here's two cups of water setting at 60 degrees. 59 degrees. It's right on the verge. So let's say 60 degrees and let's see where it goes from here. We're going. Leastways, the temperature is dropping. When it goes down to 203, I'm going to call it. Flame still going. Just about to go out. Okay, 203 at 2323. 203. 2323 let's say for going out. Now it just went back up. Interesting. Really interesting. This was just a, a what if test on this one. Okay, it just flared up a little bit. I just wanted to see what would happen. See it's just it's still trying to stay there. You, you probably can't see it but there's a little bit of flame there. Anyway, that was one half fluid ounce, about 15 milliliters of alcohol, with the carbon felt only coming up halfway on the can. Two cups of water starting at 60 degrees, got up to a high of 205, 205 degrees Fahrenheit, in 21 minutes, 45 seconds. And it stayed there until 2230, when it dropped to 204. The run out, I'm calling it at 23 minutes, 23 seconds, and the end temperature, see it's still just barely burning there. Boy, that is hot. That's where I didn't get that with the using the remote. The can didn't get that hot, but that was too hot to pick up. Anyway, 23, 23, 23 minutes, 23 seconds, 203 degrees Fahrenheit. Very interesting. The next thing I want to try with this is punching small holes around, around the top edge to see if uh, getting air in there will help it. But this is getting real close to what I want for a, a slow flame. Okay, so I thank you for watching. I look forward to your input, questions, remarks, helpful suggestions. And as always, watch for my buddy Max. Bye now.